Let's go uh, back to Slidell. Uh, that's where Officer Estes was about to search that vehicle. Woman said there was nothing in there. He said, if he doesn't find anything, he's gonna let uh, her mother pick her up, take her home. There was a two-year-old in the back seat there too. Correct. It's a, uh, I mean, driving on the influence of marijuana is equivalent to a, equivalent to driving on the influence of alcohol. I mean, you're still under the influence. Um, it's a little bit more difficult process as far as determining it. Hence why she's not gonna be able to drive this vehicle anymore. Was she able to get in touch with somebody? I'm sorry, yeah, who was that, your mom? Her mom's on the way. All right. You understand it's a big deal to be driving under the influence of marijuana with yes, a child sir. in the car. Yes, sir. I mean, that's a DWI. You understand that? And then you're putting her in danger in life. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Look I... at me. I'm gonna let your mama take y'all to home. I'm gonna give you that break. But I swear to you, if I pull you over again and you're driving with that girl and you're high, I'm gonna throw you in jail and I'm gonna call OCS for her. That's ridiculous. You wanna get stoned, that's your prerogative, but not hers. You understand? Yes, sir. She would become the victim of what you do. She don't have no control over you driving and smoking. Wait here till your mama gets here. Had you run her yet? Yeah, she's clear. She's got several violations. <laughs> Being arrested for weed. Here's your driver's license. It's freezing, dude. It's cold out. No. So, basically, what we're going to do is we're going to let her mom come pick her up, give her a ride home, then come back and get the vehicle later. And, uh, that way her child wants to sit out here in the cold and all that. She's not driving on the influence of marijuana. You heard him make a reference there to CS, that's She's child services. That's a serious threat. And as you've seen on this program, these officers do encounter the same people again sometimes. Let's all hope that does not happen here.